recently I had an opportunity to use relativity one and not like just use a little bit for a few minutes but to properly spend some time with it test it out and see how I feel about it and in this video I want to talk about three things that I think relativity got really right about relativity one and where I want to start is taking ownership of their application if you ever used relativity server you know that it resides on well your own server and you have IT department that supports it you have users who use it you may have um, a data center who's providing internet connection that is in charge of uh, routing or other things like that and so whenever there is a problem you have to deal with multiple parties to resolve it so you call your IT they say oh no it's somebody else and relativity says it's your server is not fast enough and you get a lot of finger pointing happening now I had the situation with a different application not relativity where an IT person looked at um, the server and said no 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 the server is fine there is no problem with this SQL server go call up this company and tell them to fix their SQL queries because their queries are on and of course they were on once I uh, ran the same thing on a faster server everything worked fine so point is when you have a lot of parties involved you don't have uh, that control and so it's really difficult to troubleshoot with relativity one if problem comes up it's one party that has to deal with all the problems from hardware software internet whichever of course doesn't include the internet that on the end user computer but that's what I think relativity got really right is they have complete ownership of their offering and they're fully in charge of it and they they can uh, work with it troubleshoot and make sure user experience is good and they're not dependent on anybody else now the next thing that really impressed me is ability to scale resources with the demand that you put on it so for example if I have processing job imaging or OCR I don't have to figure out how much resources I need I just run the job and software handles it for me they create additional servers as needed they submit job to those servers everything runs on its own and then those servers get shut down again if you ever used other software that controls how many licenses of what function you have or you may have to go to like a certain area of the software and check in and check out different types of licensing you know how much pain that is uh, relativity eliminates all that you don't have uh, you don't have to think about you know do you have Tiffin license do you not have Tiffin licenses how many licenses you have none of it matters what matters is you have a Tiffin job to perform and you ask a system to handle it for you and it just goes out and does it and comes back to you and tells you it's done without causing any of these headaches that other software give you like oh let me see if I have enough licenses oh, I'm just gonna take this license for so many hours because I need to OCR something oh no we have some processing we have to prioritize that first so don't take this license right you don't have any of these headaches the software just uh, scales up as needed and then scales down once the job is done and that's it it's amazing I absolutely love that aspect of it and the last thing that really impressed me is user interface speed improvements now it's really common these days to get like a remote desktop you know you ask IT hey I need to connect to my computer or something they'll give you remote desktop into team viewer into another remote desktop and everything is laggy and slow and you're like come on how can I use this this barely works and no one cares right and this is where relativity cares they optimize user interface for good experience and there are two things that they specifically optimized one is navigating around main user interface and two going from document to document now if you do go to a random document not necessarily next it is a little bit slower but going document to document which is what most people are going to do is really fast and navigating around main user interface is really fast too now things do slow down a bit if you happen to navigate somewhere away from the main area like if you go into processing or arm or something like that then yeah uh, the user interface isn't as quick but the main core interface that the reviewers so most people are going to use are uh, really fast and really pleasant to use so overall I had a very pleasant experience using relativity one uh, did you use relativity one let me know what your experience is and if there's anything that stood out to you 
right? Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to follow on LinkedIn, subscribe on YouTube, and I will see you next time.